wanted to help a couple people out deciphering whether you have a 5.3 or 4.8. Uh, these are some of the characteristics that you have. The aluminum heads. I did a simple test magnet. See, it doesn't stick at all, but it'll stick to the actual block. All right. Uh, the other thing is, let's look at the head number. 862, which is part of a bigger part number. Uh, 12559862. Uh, obviously we have our, our drive-by wire here. The other thing is you'll find the the date of manufacturing is up underneath uh, the actual water pump. And you have to get really deep into this if your water pump is still installed to find the casting date. And obviously we have our crank pulley and I'm gonna go up. You see that says G03. Okay. You also find that the, the engine block number is right on the back underneath that cylinder head. Just to kind of give you that view here. You also see the location of the cam shaft position sensor located in the middle. It's missing. Gonna replace that. see you'll see your 4L60 back here that's just to help you out quickly with some of the locations of these casting numbers and just to give you a quick look at the 60 this is the front of the engine obviously with the throttle body I wanted to show you there are some casting numbers here that's the 60 here on the driver side and the passenger side G08 on there just a quick hit about the casting date. See, it's right next to the timing cover in front of the cylinder. Yep, G143. And then that's the Jillian code that they always talk about.